My employer snitched me to the Russian army. I understand that this sub is mostly dedicated to American workers but I've been reading this sub for a couple of years and wanted to share my story. My last job was actually great. I didn't really get tired and enjoyed my days off instead of just recovering for work. Above average wages for Russia. My bosses respected me and I got promotion after a year of work. Then the war broke out and things started to collapse. I used to go to protests against Putin in 2021 and called everyone to do the same or at least vote against Putin but this time everything seemed futile. My employer called a meeting and promised to make an office in Cyprus but they didn't keep their promise. Everything started to really collapse after Putin declared mobilization. The company held another meeting but didn't tell anything really. They promised to reserve the position if somebody is drafted and then returns from war but this is not really much of a promise. The problem is that though many workers are anti-Putin most of the upper management are pro-Putin and pro-war. Of course it is easy for them. As they won't be drafted. I didn't trust my employer. So I took two days off and fled Russia. Then contacted my employer assuring I can keep working remotely. They refused and said I couldn't work anymore for them. Then they demanded me to show my flight ticket otherwise they threatened not to pay my last paycheck for vacation days I had but didn't use. Also they demanded to send my resignation papers by mail. I think it was for proving to military draft officer that they don't hide me. You see, military draft officers usually go door by door but most people just don't open the door so the easiest way for a military draft officer to draft people is to act through their employer. And that's exactly what happened in my case. A week after I left I received a message from HR manager with a photo of legal letter that I must come to military draft office. They are called Venkamat in Russia. I was so furious that I deleted the message and never replied. And that's the end of my communication with my employer. Sorry you had to leave your home, and that your former employer is in awe. Thank you for some perspective on Christmas. Solidarity around the world for workers. That is so messed up. Good on you for escaping while you can. That is so interesting what you said about most workers being anti-war. While most employers and management are pro-war. What a good demonstration of class interests. Obviously the workers have no interest in an imperialist war that would hurt their living standards. And that they would mostly be drafted for. And that definitely makes sense that the capitalists would support a war in favor of expanding Russian territory. As that would allow them to gain more capital. Again, good on you for saving yourself while you can. Hopefully Russian workers can unite and topple the government. To prevent further imperialist conflict. Your employer is a sicka bliat. Sucks that you have to upend your life in order to avoid dying in a pointless war run by a sick, dying megalomaniac. Proud of you for what you're doing. Standing up for what is right for the world. Best of luck. Be safe. I feel like what you faced with your employer is minor compared to what you would face being drafted. The fact you got out. I consider you quite lucky. Good thing you got away in time. Hopefully you can find an even better job somewhere else. Good luck. American here. I am glad you trusted your instincts but please stay safe out there. I can't imagine how scary it is over there given your situation. Sorry to hear your employers are incredibly heartless as to support a war like this. Employer is pro-fascist, placed your life in danger literally. It may be primarily Americans. From what I can gather. But anyone can air their grievances and find support no matter where they are in the world. I'm so glad you are safe.
I know it doesn't really count for anything but I'm so sorry you had to go through all of that. If you ever need to let it out, we're here for you. Be safe and warm. I hope things get better for you soon. I wish nothing but the best for you in the coming years. Whoa this is dark. Best of luck to you, sir. Glad you made it out heart. Best of luck. Good for you leaving. I hope you are safe and stay safe. You should name the company as they do not deserve your loyalty and you absolutely should not. Return home. Well you escaped so that's the main thing. Well done. Proud of you. Hope you're in a more stable situation now, op. Fellow human. This is one of the most anti-work anti-work stories I've ever heard. This sub is truly for all the world's downtrodden. Not just us poor American saps. I am grateful for people like you who live for what's right. Stay strong. Yikes. That's really horrible. I'm glad you got away. I hope the war ends. The Russian war against Ukraine is so pointless. Killing innocent people and destroying people's lives. Why do humans do such horrible things to each other? If you enjoyed this video, please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epic Heracast is like doom scrolling for your ears. Please like, share, and subscribe.